Hey guys, welcome back to another video today. Um, so I got a different video for you guys today. But yes, I got a different video for you guys today. What it is is this. So I usually use, okay, I usually use this mouse right here. It is MSI Clutch GM08. See in the bottom. That's the mouse I usually use right here. It's a really good lightweight mouse. You can also change the weights on the bottom. But beside that, I got another mouse. It is a uh, Logitech G502 Hero. And it is a super good mouse. <laughs> it has a lot of buttons. I did have it in the box, and I was doing an unboxing where I literally just. Well, the second time I did it, uh, there was a couple stuff I didn't know about this. You guys will see what I didn't know about it in the video later. Okay, let's head into it. So I'm going to be testing out like editing, aiming, all the different stuff on both the, the different mice and different buttons and because there's a lot. And yeah, well, let's head into the video. Well, let's thank you before I head into it. I also know it says Fortnite in the background because you have a green screen, but... Only 46% of you guys subscribe, so make sure to hit the subscribe button, like the video, and also turn on the notification so you never miss an upload, because we are at uh, 298 subs, 2 away, and then I get egged, so get ready for that. But yes, again, let's head in. So maybe you can see that I have earbud in right now. Uh, one of my animals broke my other headset. I'm pulling it and snapped off. It, you know the thing that plugs into your phone or whatever, or your PC or wherever you're but anyways beside that let's get into uh aim first and th since there's three different things we're doing aim editing and then just overall free building like just uh feel we're just gonna be testing three different things so there's three different points in total whatever gets most more points i'm gonna be saying and again this is not again but this is not sponsored so yeah really wish it was but but Let's see, I'm playing with my regular mouse right now. Here, let's head into the aiming thing. Okay, so we're here, but really quick, you can't help to notice, but my dog in the camera. Like, he's being super cute. Well, he's asleep, okay. Well, so, we are going to be doing 60 meters and 1 minute timer for both of them, and however many kills we get. I'm going to try to make this as short as possible while I'm on 50. Yes, I'm just going to put it to 120 right now, because my monitor sucks right now. But yeah, let's do this. I'm not. I'm actually not gonna show you guys this because I'm trying to make it as short as possible. Because when I recorded it last time, it was like 25 minutes. I know you guys don't like that, so I'm just gonna skip ahead and tell you guys what I got for the uh, my regular mouse I always use. Regular mouse I always use. I had to pull the cord longer. Yeah, let's do it. Okay, so uh, with this mouse, I got my regular mouse. I got four kills, and you guys may not believe me. Like, ah, you're better than that. But it's actually hard. The mo jump moving randomly, and even though the middle of the AR, like the ADS area, the middle of it is right on them, it just sometimes won't hit because when you're spraying. Okay. Well, next this one and this one is even just from moving it around, it feels so smooth. And the the uh, uh it, the DPI is the same, so they're all good. Now we're gonna be trying it. I'll tell you guys how many kills I get from this. And I'm not lying to you guys. I would not do that. Okay, surprisingly this thing felt super smooth i almost got six kills because it's like three or four shots to kill one of them i literally got like i think it was four i think it's four shots depending on if you get headshots i hit three shots on one of them and i almost got six kills i got five and this thing feels super smooth like light they're both the same weight it just feels like it slides better i can't really explain it but this thing won for in a, for this one why did i do it again but um yeah, I'm going to go try the other aim ones, and I'll tell you guys which one overall got more points. And So I'm going to be doing... I'm going to tell you which one I'm going to be doing. I'm going to be doing this whole row now. And wh whoever gets the most points out of this whole row, I will like tell you guys which one's better for aiming. Okay, so surprisingly, because I'm used to my regular mouse. I can't get it in the camera because of the cord. But I'm surprised. Like, really surprised it. Uh, Logitech one actually won, even though I'm used to the weight on this mouse because they could be at, like tiniest amount of difference. Plus the DPI could be just the tiniest amount of difference and everything. Like 
it's, it's I'm actually very surprised but now we're doing editing and this should be pretty easy for me because I'm a pro you guys know totally I have pretty decent edits so uh, first of all I'm just gonna warm up with my edits oh my god yeah okay, I'm not gonna show you guys too much of this as this just gonna be doing random stuff to get used to my edits Okay, I think I'm gonna do one. I'm gonna go through all of these all the way to six. Actually, not six because six is just dumb. To four because five and six are really dumb. If you want to just more do an end course, one, two, three, four, and are just the good ones. So I'm gonna go through them. Then I'm gonna do the Logitech one with editing, and I'll tell you guys which one's better. And also, I'm going by time. So once I get done with all these, I'll show you the time for my regular mouse, and then I'll show you the one for the Logitech. Okay, so I'm gonna. I'm actually gonna go for number one. Number one, I got 132 for my normal mouse I always use. 150. And also, again, just for the guys that are getting confused, I use this mouse. I finally moved it. This is the Logitech mouse. They're different because the logo. If you guys can even see that in the camera, because that's a dragon. Okay, so one, 132. Two, I got 150. Three, 145. And four, I got 142. I'm gonna try to beat them with the Logitech mount. Nah, I'm just kidding. I'm just gonna just edit like normal. And those are pretty fast times. Like, I beat this time 140 to 132. But yeah, let's do it. Well, I'm gonna give you guys a little secret. Uh, if you look at these paintings, it says an interact. You can interact and get XP. You guys don't know that. But I would go through all the courses first, because once you go through all of them, then you get more XP when you do it. And you can do it through that painting, that painting, that one. Oh, well, what? Why does it still say the interact thing? I don't know, but now Logitech mouse. Probably not gonna be as good, but I need to get warmed up on my edits like just right here for now. Cause Okay, I'm just gonna get warmed up and then I'm gonna go through one, two, three, four again. Now I'll show you guys the times. First of all, first thoughts of it. I'm they're both really good mice. That's why I'm recording this video. Because if you guys are thinking like what mice what mouse should I get? Um first of all I'm trying them. The Logitech, I'm pretty sure it said it had a really low input delay, so, and I can already tell. Just look at this, guys. So I can, uh, the scroll wheel a bit fast, maybe I can slow that down, because there's, I'll tell you guys in the end why. Just remember when I said I'm, I want to slow that down, otherwise, yeah, it's super smooth, but let's go through one, two, three, and The same exact time. Okay, but overall, like, the... I didn't really mess up on as much edits. I just, I, uh, like, slowed down a lot more for some reason. Like, I stopped walking a lot. Then I moved some stuff on my desk, like my phone. I have to do it again. But otherwise, it feels so smooth. Like I said, with the aiming, it, like, slides across the desk. So smooth. But uh, let's do two, three, four. As we get the same time on all of them. Pretty sure for two, I got one minute and 50 seconds. I got five more than what it was here, and then I got five more from what it was here. Let's do it. Yeah, I'm just gonna show you guys, like, after every one. I'm just gonna show you guys. So, I got five more than this. One minute and 50. I got one minute and 42. So, better already. And it's not that I'm getting better. I stopped for a second, so that's gonna whoa, that's gonna bring off some why the heck is the sensitivity so fast now? Okay, I probably not can't do this one. Yeah. I need to figure out what's wrong with the DPI and then I'll go. But that one does not count. Okay, so for the fourth one, it was a minute 15. I actually don't think, and that's not right. I'm not saying that I don't think that's not right. And I had to stop because the DPI was like this fast. I'll show you guys. Ready? And I could not like move at all. Like, I'm just barely sliding my mouse. Like maybe like that far across my desk. It's just literally. Yeah, well, the DPI got messed up, and it took, I had to open up the app, and I would have saved this for later, but I just had to tell you guys, so I opened up the app, and I figured out how to change it, like what was down, how to get it up again, 
And yeah, so I got it back to uh, what it was at. And I'm going to say it took like 20 seconds. So I'm going to say it was like 1, maybe 1.30. 130 somewhere around there so I beat my score here and on the other one so overall this thing is just super smooth though Okay, but now I'm gonna go into free build and see how it is just overall like doing edits just crazy so let's go So we're just gonna be doing it in this map. Oh, what the heck? I like froze for a second Double edits, so single, double, ah, oh, I barely messed up the triple, there you go, triple, now we're going to try to do quad. Just doing the main one right now, I always do the main one first, so you get, no, why does it place it so late? There we go, quadded, right there. Okay, now we're gonna try the Logitech mouse before because it's 13 minutes long right now. Switching this way, it's gonna go this way. Okay, Logitech mouse now. Try it. Okay, let's do the same thing I did earlier. So, oh, uh, that was the end of the build there. I need to stop doing that. Single edit. Double edit. This mouse is so smooth. Okay. On the... I never use this mouse. And I got it quicker than I got it on my other mouse. Also, I do edit out parts. And I did like four or five quad edits on my other mouse. And I've gotten it way faster on the, uh, this mouse than on the other mouse. Oops. I thought I was doing a double edit there. See if I can do it again. First try again. Let's come on. Nope. I hate how it sometimes it doesn't place for me. Like my keyboard just doesn't want to work. Oh, yes. <laughs> Here you go. Alright, change the DFPI. Change the DPI again. I don't need to place anything there. But it's really comfortable. It's a comfortable mouse. Like if you were just going to... Like... It's really comfortable. I'm gonna say it's more comfortable than my mouse, but I need to get used to it because um, it's like different size than my other mouse. So um, the buttons are different sizes, like the side buttons. I accidentally changed the DPI thing, which is annoying because look, here is the right uh, left mouse button. Here are the DPI things. It's like, don't mind me shooting, but DPI buttons are right here. So watch, I'm gonna click it and look at my sensitivity way faster but anyways yeah that's how you change the sensitivity and stuff which is annoying because i'll accidentally click it i accidentally clicked it again but um if you get ever get annoyed at that i'm gonna be making a video on how to fix it tomorrow so the day this comes out the next day there's gonna be another video because and it's gonna be on there's an app there's an app how to change the buttons you can change the dpi in the app you can rebind some of the bu like buttons you can change the colors and I'm going to be making a tutorial, and it's going to be my second tutorial of my YouTube channel. So if you want to see that, like it says in the bottom, subscribe, like, and turn on the notifications. That's what you need to do so you don't miss it tomorrow. It's going to be at the same time. Whenever I post this, it's going to be at the exact same time the next day. And yeah, so don't miss that. If I got used to this thing, I would not be messing up a single well, edit. Like, and I probably won't change the DPI. And it's like, there's hardly any delay. Whoops, actually changed the DVI again. I'm gonna try something, guys. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Macros. But otherwise, I would recommend this. It's a really good, there's 17 minutes in this, so I'm gonna stop it. But go subscribe. I'm gonna be posting a video tomorrow of how to use the app, how to change the binds and everything like that. Go check it out. I'm probably gonna start using this mouse. No, I'm going to get used to it. I might see it more because I'm going to be using a hand cam. If you guys were on the live stream last night, because uh, actually two nights ago when I post this, uh, for you two nights ago, you watched it. I was using a hand cam. If you want to go look at it, it's going to be in the description of this video. The, uh, like, you know, the thing. Or it's going to be at the top of the screen right now if you want to go watch the live stream. 
where I used the hand cam. I didn't really use this mouse, but I'm going to be using it soon. So, yeah, I would recommend this mouse, 100%, over my mouse. It's the Logitech. I'm going to be leaving, leaving a link to both the mice down in the description, and I'll name them. The MSI one I use, the Logitech, is the one that I'm going to be using because it's way better. So, yes, go check out the live stream if you haven't. It's going to be at the top of the screen right now, top, just anywhere on the top of the screen. This mouse is the best. Go subscribe. It's way better than my mouse. And I'm going to be making a tutorial tomorrow, so please watch it on how to change the binds, colors, and everything like that. So go watch it tomorrow. Well, whenever you watch this. Okay, so, uh, this is another thing I edited in to the video that you guys are watching right now. So, I missed a couple stuff about this, and earlier in the video, I said that there's some stuff I didn't know about the mouse. That's why I messed up on the first time I recorded it. That's why I recorded it again. So the first thing I messed up is I said I would not re recommend this mouse if you have screw or reset in Fortnite because I'm recording it for Fortnite. If you want me to do it for Warzone and a couple other games, well, guys, because you could change. Okay, I will explain this for now, but I'm explaining a lot to you guys. So again, if you guys want me to do f a different game, you guys can ask me. Use the mouse on Fall Guys. Which one's better for that? I will do that stuff for you guys. You just need to comment down below what game you guys would like me to try. I'll do Valorant, a whole bunch of other different stuff. You guys just try and tell me. But I said I would not recommend it for Fortnite if you have scroll or reset because it just keeps going. And I figured out this thing. There's a button right here. There's two buttons. Button right here and a button right here. If you click this one, then it stops. Then it spins. So you can have it where it just stops right away. Or if you click it again, you can have it where it spins forever. So this is a DPI changer I would not like to use. So, here's the back one, right right here. If I click this, the DPI goes down. If I click this, the DPI goes higher. So that means my mouse sensitivity goes higher. So this is a, so this far back one is right here. Gosh, this far back one right here is down in sensitivity. This is up in sensitivity. This is another DPI shifter, but otherwise, yeah. So I would recommend this mouse. And another thing is, it's really good for all, all games, I'm gonna say. And the reason why is because you're able to change the binds what the different buttons do in the hero app and i'm going to be making a video and again like i said it's going to be out tomorrow at the same time this video is out so if this video is out at 7 p.m it's going to be 7 p.m the next day but whatever time this is this video is out it's the next day that i uh, will be posting that other tutorial and it's my second tutorial i said that earlier in the video but thank you guys so much please hit the notifications so you don't miss tomorrow's upload about how to change the binds how to change the dpi but if you don't know what dpi you're on you can check the dpi just go do that and sub, like, and notifications. Again, notifications. You'll see it tomorrow. Or okay, well, bye bye guys. I don't know why I said that, but I will see you guys next video tomorrow.